I've made other videos about Google Alerts and the cool things you can do with Google Alerts where you can just set a search thing that sends you a message. Um, every time a certain search term comes up new on the internet and Google discovers it, Google will send you an alert. And I've made other videos about how to set alerts in Google Alerts, easy for me to say. But this video is going to show you how to cancel a Google Alert if you want to. So you're just going to go to your Google Alerts, so google.com slash alerts. You'll go into here and just look at alerts. Now you'll see I've got 13 set in here. I've got one set for my wife's my name. I've got one for identity theft secrets, which is one I set years ago on a web project I was working on. I've got one for my own name, which I probably need to revise because I get lots of results for the owner of the New England Patriots. But I still get that once a week. I have one for kind of my moniker on the internet. But let's just say right here I don't want to get Google Alerts anymore for this Cole Fuzbo Denver. That's for sale by owner and I was just curious if there was a for sale by owner in the Cole neighborhood if I would get any notifications on that. Well, I don't really need to get notifications on that anymore because I'm not going to be buying a house in the Cole neighborhood unless it's crazy cheap, which no house in Denver is crazy cheap in 2016. It's just not happening here this year. So maybe I want to go in and edit this and I can say, you know, I want this once a day or I want it once a week. I want it as it happens. I can also choose from a variety of sources in here. Um, or if I just want to change my results in here, I can just go back and I go into my alerts and I can just delete this alert altogether and then it's no longer one of my Google Alerts. It's just been removed from my account. I can undo it if I want to, if I wanted to put it back in my account. But that is how I would go into my Google Alerts and delete an alert that had recently or that I'd added to my account that I wanted to get rid of. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos almost every single day. If you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.